Hello everyone and welcome to Sincerely Grace. Today I am going to be doing a handbag review on the Louis Vuitton Neverfull in the GM size. I'm going to be going over the pros and the cons and why I would recommend this handbag. So let's get started. So I first want to start off with the pros of the handbag. Um, I actually own this handbag in two different canvases. I own it in the Damier Bean canvas, and then I also own it in the regular Monogram canvas. Now, if I had to choose one of these purses, hands down, it would be this purse. I love this purse. Um, I actually have owned this purse previously and then I sold it and realized it was a big mistake. Why? Um, because I realized that this handbag, for me at least, it's more of a winter handbag and I'm not able to use it year round as opposed to the monogram. I'm able to go ahead and use it during the summer, during the winter, um, and I feel that it goes well with every outfit that you choose, whether it be black, whether it be spring bright color. Um, just really recommend the Never Fool in the monogram canvas. One of the obvious pros of this purse is the size of this purse. This thing is humongous. And that's one of the reasons why I love it so much. You're able to fit so much into it. Um, you're able to go ahead and use this as a backpack if you're a student. I actually did. I would go ahead and put my notepads, my books, and also my laptop in here and everything would fit. Um, and you're also able to carry this throughout your transition of life. Whenever I was a student, um, now that I'm a mom, I actually can double this as a diaper bag. Put your diapers, your wipes, snacks, extra clothes, you name it, everything fits in here. Also, if you'd like to travel a lot, you can actually go ahead and use this as your carry-on bag. You can use this as an overnight bag if you're staying one or two days. I mean, everything can fit in here. I like to say that this is my mini suitcase. So my second pro for this handbag is this handbag actually comes with a detachable pouch that can be doubled as a wallet or a clutch. Um, I know a lot of people utilize that as a clutch. I actually sold mine. Um, I didn't have much use out of it, but I definitely think it can be a pro if you're able to take advantage of that extra add-on. My third pro for this handbag has to be how timeless this bag is. I've had this purse for about five years and it just never seems to go out of style. It's definitely worth your money, definitely worth the investment. Um, like I said, I've had this purse previously. I made the mistake of selling it and then rebought it. Um, this is definitely a forever piece in my handbag collection. One of the cons that I would say, and probably the only con for this bag, is how easy it is to get in and out of. Just for security purposes, and especially being a mom, um, I would definitely want to have a zipper here at the top, which it doesn't have. The only way that I can secure my purse is if I'm carrying it and I cinch in the sides, which adds a little bit of security, but still, I mean, if you're in a public place, somebody can easily just stick in their hand. And also if you set your purse down at a doctor's office or at a public place, you just need to make sure that it's close to you. Um, other than that, I absolutely love the Louis Vuitton Never Full, especially in the GM size. I definitely recommend it. Definitely recommend um, looking at it as your first luxury purchase. I also want to show you how this looks on my body frame. I am 5'7 and around 130 pounds. For me, it was a no-brainer to get the Neverfull GM just because of how tall I am. Um, the PM and the MM were just too small for me. I definitely recommend if you are considering purchasing this bag, is going to the store and trying it out and just making sure that it looks well depending on your body frame and that it works for your lifestyle. For me, it was a no-brainer to get the GM. Um, so let me go ahead and show you what it looks like. Um, I'll show you both ways. So this is how it looks with 
it opened. So as you can see, it's pretty big. It looks a little bit smaller once you cinch in the sides. And I actually prefer to wear it this way whenever I'm out, just like I said, for security purposes. But either way, to me, this bag is gorgeous um, and strongly would recommend this bag. So that is all for today. I hope that you enjoyed my handbag review. If you'd like to see more videos in regards to fashion and lifestyle, definitely go ahead and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye.